Good evening all you beautiful people, it's me again, I'm on my last shift <laughs> It's been uh, it's been quite an adventurous week actually, first week with the DHL so uh, A few teething problems, uh, you know, which is only to be expected, they've only, they've only been on, uh, in the chair for a week so You know, expect great things in the future, I'm sure, uh, it, it, it can only get better I hope <laughs> But uh, you know, it is what it is. It, all trucking firms are the same. When they take over, you know, there's there's always going to be issues here and there, and then you know they they set up their own train set, and then you know things start running smoothly. However, last night was <laughs> was an absolute nightmare. I only had a, a a run down to Ashford with an empty trailer. It took me two hours uh, before I got an empty trailer. Even before I set off, I was two hours late. So. Uh, and every motorway that I hit, the M1 uh, from the M6, the Cap 4 interchange, that was closed. Couldn't get on the 14, couldn't get on the M1. Uh, that was a great start. Well, prior to that, the M42 uh, was closed as well. Uh, then the M1 and then the M25, junction 27 to 28, that was closed. Uh, obviously I had to go down the M11 and then cut across 13, 13 was closed, 4 hours 26 minutes to get to Ashford. <laughs> it was pop. So got there and the guy that was that was loading me because I was getting live loaded, he says oh yeah uh, just park on the on the very first base, I says, I'm just going for a tea break, I went, yeah yeah no worries mate. I'd love a cup of tea myself, like, but no problems. I'll just, I'll just sit here and wait. Can't be long. One hour later, it tips up. And I got there at four o'clock, ready, good to go. And usually it only takes about half an hour to, to load, uh, 25 minutes if uh, the other guy's doing it. He's really good. An hour. How long does it take to drink a cup of tea? But no, he went home for his tea <laughs> oh my god yeah that was a <clears throat> that was a moment uh, they took him another half hour to load me in and by the time I got away they ate all the traffic on the M25 it was just carnage uh, 10 minutes short of 15 hours <laughs> was when I clocked off <laughs> so by the time I got home Washed all my stuff up, had a quick shower, uh, went to bed about 10 to 1, uh, 30, uh, 12.50, so, you know, and then uh, I was up again at half past five, so I, I barely had four and a half hours sleep. And now I'm down in Alling, Allington, which is near Maidstone. <laughs> May as well send me to Ashford. <laughs> so, uh, like I say, it is what it is. But I'm down here. I'm gonna have a. I'm gonna have 45 minutes. I'm gonna have my break. I'm gonna get my head down, uh, and then I'm gonna set off because uh, I've got quite a lot to do when I get home. <sighs> my day never ends. <laughs> so I hope you all have a great weekend. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get out and play because the weather has been absolutely rubbish. So, um, yeah, I'm going to spend some time with my grandson. I'm going to take him to a soft play area. Uh, and I'm going to chuck him in the ball pit. <laughs> I'm going to dive in there myself. <laughs> Throw all the other kids out. And it's just my grandson. So, yeah, that, it's, going to be, it's going to be brutal this weekend. He's, he's going to love it. So, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to that. So, like I say, hope you all have a fantastic weekend. Um, drive safe, stay safe. Leave a comment, like and subscribe, and I'll see you crazy cats on No I won't <laughs> because I'm off I'm off Sunday and Monday night. However, I might ping ping out a few videos. We'll see. Alright guys, cheers.